Hello, Namaste, Salam Walaikum, Sastriyakal. Welcome back to another session with your washer at Vareva.com. Today I am going to show you another very interesting and fantastic kebab. This is potato la jawab. For this, first we are going to take a boiled potato and you know just cut them into half inch roundels. Okay. Little thinner also would do. Now look at these uh, roundels, that should be good. And these uh, roundels will be coated with uh, nice marinade and we are going to shallow fry. Now we are going to make a very thick uh, marinade and we are going to use hung curd for this. You know we have made dahi kebab, this outside coating is going to be that of dahi kebab. Basically what we did is we just took the yogurt, put it in a muslin cloth and we hung it for uh, 2 hours and that's when this curd becomes nice and thick. In this we are going to season it with uh, salt some chili powder, chopped coriander, make sure all the things used in this uh, marinade are going to be finely chopped. You are going to look here that even the ginger has been so finely chopped. You know I don't usually like to use ginger garlic paste when I make these kind of kebabs and uh, because I, I, I never tell you to use ginger garlic paste instead I tell you to use the chopped one because if you put the ginger garlic paste that has been sitting in fridge for a couple of days your kebab will smell. That's why if you make it fresh ginger garlic paste you are okay to use and here I have got very finely chopped garlic also and similarly I have got very finely chopped green chilli. This is to give little extra spice and in this we are going to add some chaat masala. The chaat masala has got all the masalas and also a little bit of sarnas to it. So we are going to add little uh, chaat masala into it. To give a nice herby flavour we are going to add some powder of uh, kasuri methi. And because there is good amount of moisture in this, just to control it and also make it a nice coating, put the dalia, the roasted chana dal into your blender and make it into a powder and add a little bit into this. Squeeze in a little bit of lime juice and we are going to mix, mix this and make this into a nice coating. You know, you have to taste this because this has to be perfect so that your potato la jawab kebabs come out excellent. Now because these potatoes are boiled and uh, you know uh, they are soft you just take this marinade and put it on top of this uh, a spoonful on top of each potato slice and just spread it a little bit. Oh wow I'm telling you this will taste so good so good you will not believe it. Wow. Now on a pan just take some oil and take these potatoes and very carefully put it upside down ok. Do not move the potatoes once uh, they sit there just turn the pan little bit so that whatever extra oil I will add some more oil here put it upside down. Now the curd that is there on the other side will cook and it will become solid coating onto the uh, potatoes. We are going to take some more of this mixture and we are going to coat it on the other side also. You know these kind of interesting kebabs we make uh, pretty often for you know our 5 star hotel guests but you can make them at home and enjoy these awesome kebabs. Now you know cook it on a slow flame till they get a nice golden color on both sides and these potatoes are fantastic now and since the potatoes are already cooked you know all you need to is uh, get these um, flavors into it and then you are done. Now you know once these kebabs cook on both sides just transfer it into a plate, serve them piping hot and they will taste fantastic. Look at these kebabs just with the spinach chutney, mm. wow you know I think the outside marinade is what giving this the real punch that is needed. Mm. Wow. Dear friends, I hope you enjoyed today's session of learning how to make this alu la jawab kebab with your washer. But do not forget, Vareva is all about inspiring others to cook. So please post your recipes and cooking tips at vareva.com so others can benefit from your great cooking. Thank you. Bye bye. Mm.